Good morning, boys and girls. How are you guys doing today? That's great to hear. I hope you had a great weekend. I did, even though it was raining. It was kind of relaxing and um, got to watch a bunch of movies and snuggle with my kids. Um, today I'm going to read you a book um, and it's actually one of my favorites. Have you guys seen the movie Finding Nemo? Well, when my oldest boy was little, that was our favorite movie. And we drove in a car across the country from Washington State to Arkansas. And we drove for 11 hours a day for four days. Can you count them with me? One, two, three, four. I memorized virtually every line of the movie. And so for some reason, I have always just loved Finding Nemo. So today I'm going to read you one of his books that I found. I couldn't believe I still had it, but here we go. Um, so what part of the book is this? Front, back, and this is the spine. What's your spine do? We'll do together. Where is your spine? Very good. Okay, <clears throat> so um, this book is Finding Nemo Just Keep Swimming. What's another name for that? The title. Good job, guys. Can't pull anything over on you. Um, the author does what? <laughs> he writes the words. And who draws the pictures? The illustrator. Great job. Okay. Nemo has a dream. He wants to join the school swim team. Can you guys swim? Have you practiced? Maybe that's something that you guys can do this summer. But Nemo has a little fin. He thinks that he will never win. Should we um, say that we never win or that we'll try to win? We should always try, right? So Dory, she helps Nemo. She teaches him to go, go, go. Nemo races and races. Nemo chases and chases. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. That's what Dory's telling Nemo. But Nemo thinks of other things. I'll never win. I have a bad fin. We'll see. Nemo is being um, a pessimist where Dory is an optimist. Optimistic means you're always looking for the good and Nemo is thinking of the bad. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. Just keep swimming, says Dory. So Nemo tries and he tries. And he keeps on trying. What do you think might happen next if we keep trying? Nemo races and races and he chases and chases. Yippee! Yahoo! Dreams really do come true. And Nemo makes the team. Look how excited and happy he is. He didn't give up though, did he? Dory kept telling him, try and try and try again. Can Nemo win first place? Hmm, let's find out. Just keep swimming, 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 Dory cries. She's encouraging him, meaning she's saying positive things. Go, you can do this. Just keep swimming, swimming. Watch him race, watch him chase. Watch as Nemo wins first place. Good job, boys and girls. So what did we learn about this story? This story tells us that um, even though we think we might be able, not be able to do something because it's hard or we've never done it before or we have something that um, challenges us, challenges us, whether it be that um, we have to wear glasses or um, whatever, 
a little thing that you think is going to hold you back, if you think positive thoughts, if you believe in yourself, if you keep trying and trying, someday you too will succeed. Can't wait to see you tonight at the kindergarten graduation. Bye-bye.